Duff Fredonia duly called and held on the 27th day of February 2012 at 7.30 p.m. in the trustees room, second floor, Village Hall, Fredonia, New York. And public notice of the time and place of this meeting has been given to the news media and conspicuously posted in one or more designated public locations in accordance with section 104 of the open meetings law. Whereas members of this board president at this meeting have read the official minutes of the Board of Trustees regular meeting of February 13, 2012. Now therefore be it resolved that this board approves the minutes and enter the official minutes and be it further resolved that the reading of the minutes be dispensed with. All in favor say aye. Aye. Second. Opposed? Passed. Reports. Uh, we have one report tonight from the uh, building inspector um, for January of 2012. Total of seven building permits issued with a valuation of $123,600, $788.80 collected in fees, 14 certificates of compliance for residential rental property, $1,310 collected in fees, uh, 22 certificates of compliance for commercial fire and safety inspections, $2,900 collected in fees. Total fees for the month of January were $4,998.80. Correspondence. Uh, correspondence was received from Mary Butcher, Secretary, on behalf of the First United Methodist Church of Fredonia, requesting permission to use Barker Common in the gazebo on April 8, 2012, for an Easter sunrise worship service. Be resolved that the request from Mary E. Butcher, Secretary, on behalf of the First United Methodist Church of Fredonia, to use Barker Common in the gazebo on April 8, 2012, from 6.15 a.m until 7.15 a.m. for an Easter sunrise worship service is hereby approved subject to the direction of the police department and the village receiving a certificate of insurance of at least one million naming the village as an additional insured which the village has received. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? <coughs> Missed. <coughs> Correspondence was received from Justice David Prince, notifying the board that he has received a grant from the State of New York Unified Court System Justice Court Assistance Program for the purchase of office furniture and equipment. I believe that was for 8,600 change. Third correspondence was received from Jefferson Westwood, expressing concern for public safety while attempting to cross Main Street, Route 20 in the village of Fredonia. You know, what I'd like to do with this is um, Brad and Jack and, and Sam, if you'd like to be involved also, and, and any trustees would like to get involved, I think we ought to have a meeting and discuss what we can do for the safety of, of the village as far as traffic. Okay. Um, want me to send out an email? And you can get back to me at what's convenient for you? Okay. And uh, I'll CC everyone else on that email also. Okay. Public portion. Would anyone like to address the board this evening? <laughs> well, High school students always address the board. You got to say something. <laughs> <laughs> now, what we could do is um, wish Mike well. Tonight's Mike's last night with the uh, with working with the village. He's going to be moving on to Jamestown. Oh, man. oh. Who's, who's taking over? <laughs> And we appreciate your work that you've done for us. Um, resolutions. Whereas Lori M. Richardson has provisionally qualified for a higher level position as senior account clerk pers pursuant to section 22 of the New York State Civil Service Law Determination and whereas the village administrator, Richard St. George, has nominated Mrs. St. George, Mrs. <coughs> Mrs. Richardson for a non-competitive promotion exam for a senior account clerk is allowed by section 52 subsection 7 of the New York State Civil Service Law and whereas the change in the higher level position became effective with the New York State Civil Service on February 20, 2012. Now therefore be it resolved that Lori M. Richardson is hereby promoted to position of a senior account clerk on a provisional basis pending the taking, the taking and passing of a civil service test and subject to civil, ser civil service rules regulations and subject to probationary period of six months. This resolution is effective February 20th, 2012. Second. All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed? Passed. Be it resolved that the regular and overtime payrolls of various village departments and bills approved by the Finance Committee and set forth in the abstract 
number 426, is hereby approved and directed and paid. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Passed. Be resolved that Joshua Kozlowski, Central Avenue, Dunkirk, and Jeffrey Ortolano, uh, Fredoni, New York, are hereby appointed the position of part-time police officers on an as-needed basis at a rate pay of $12 per hour with no other benefits effective immediately subject to civil service rules and regulations. Second. All in favor. All in favor. Aye. 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 Opposed? Passed. Whereas the village of Fredonia is about to undertake certain water line improvements in the Holmes Place area near the CSX railroad tracks, which will involve installing an 8 inch diameter water main under CSX tracks. Whereas CSX Transportation Incorporated requires a facility encroachment agreement to be, oh, to be approved and signed by the village as a condition to granting permission to the village to excavate under the railroad property and to install a water main in, whereas the facility encroachment agreement between CSX and the village of Fredonia dated as of February 7, 2012 has been revealed by this board. Now therefore be resolved that the agreement is, is hereby approved and the mayor is hereby authorized to sign said agreement on behalf of the village of Fredonia and be it further resolved that in accordance with the agreement to the village, <coughs> Pay CSX a sum of $4,900 and provide CSX the requested liability insurance certificate. Second. All in favor? Say aye. 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 Opposed? Passed. <coughs> whereas the village of Fredonia is about to undergo certain improvements to the home place water main, and whereas some of the water main work will be performed on a property of Lawrence D. Spacapoli, located at 36 Bryant Place, Fredonia, village of Fredonia, and whereas the village attorney has given Mr. Spacapoli Spacchiapoli and his attorney have proposed water main easement to sign, and whereas Ma Mr. Spacchiapoli has indicated his willingness to sign said water main easement, provided the village releases its current sewer easement on this property and re relocate the sewer main in order to remove any house encroachment of the sewer main. And whereas Mr. Jack Boland, village uh, DPW supervisor, has reviewed the matter with Mr. Spacchiapoli and has also reviewed the proposed new location of the sewer main on his property, which Mr. Spacchiapoli has agreed with. Now, therefore, be it resolved that the village hereby accepts the water main easement and authorizes it to be recorded in the Chautauqua County Clerk's Office. And the mayor is also hereby authorized to sign said easement on behalf of the village. And be it further resolved that the village agrees to locate the sewer main on Mr. Spacchiapoli's property at village expense by December 31st, 2013, or sooner, if possible. Provided Mr. Spacchiapoli grants per permanent sewer easement to the village for new sewer main in, in form and content satisfactory to the village, and be it further resolved upon completion of the new sewer main and receipt of the new sewer easement, the village agrees to release the present sewer easement from the Spacchiapoli's property, and be it further resolved that the mayor is hereby authorized to sign all papers necessary to accomplish the above. Second. All in favor? Say aye. 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 Opposed? Passed. Whereas Title VI, uh, NYCRR Part 617.5 of the regulations relating to Art Article 8 of the Environmental Conservation Law of New York State, um, requires that as early as possible in a proposed action, an involved agency shall make a determination whether a given aspect or a given action is subject to a seeker. And whereas all board of trustees of the village of Fredonia had due notice of this meeting and that pursuant to section 94 of the public officer's law, said meeting was to open to the general public and due and proper notice of the time and place thereof was given as required by law. And whereas a short form environmental assessment form prepared by Tolman Engineering of Jamestown, New York, covering the village's proposed action, Said action being the installation of the water mains and water in Holmes Place and Newton Street and uh, installation of sewer mains on West Main Street is shown on plans and specifications prepared by Tolman Engineering which have been reviewed by this board. Now therefore be it resolved that the Board of Trustees of Village of Fredonia pursuant to Part 617 of the New York of NYCRR determined, hereby determines that the proposed action is a Type 2 action and does not involve any federal agency and is an unlisted action. And be it further resolved that the Board of Trustees of the Village of Fredonia, after due deliberation and review of the short environmental assessment form prepared by Tolman Engineering, a copy of which is here uh, is attached here to, uh, hereby determines that the proposed action will not have a significant adverse impact on the environment, 
and that this resolution shall constitute a negative declaration for the purposes of Article 8 of the Environmental Conservation Law of New York State, and be it further resolved that the mayor is hereby authorized to sign said short form, CICRA form, on behalf of the village of Fredonia. One, second. One little correction oh. on that uh, second page, the first resolve, the words and is an unlisted action. So it's, a, it's, just a, it's just a type 2 action, not an unlisted. Type 2 means uh, it's replacement, it's nothing, nothing new, it's not a you know, start from the beginning project, it's replacement, and that's a type 2 action, which really doesn't require an environmental issue. <coughs> Okay, and we can just use that as a typo error then? Yep. Okay. Second. Okay. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? It passed. Whereas plans and specifications have been prepared by the village consulting engineer, Tolman Engineering of Jamestown, New York, for the construction of the new water main for Holmes Place and part of Newton Street and construction of new sewer mains for West Main Street, now therefore be resolved. Said plans and specifications are hereby approved, and it be further resolved that this board determines the said project as a type two action and does not require a CICRA review, and be it further resolved that the village clerk is, here, is hereby authorized to advertise for sealed bids for said project. Said bids to be returnable to the village clerk's office no later than 10 a.m. on Wednesday, March 28, 2012, and at which time for the bid shall be publicly open and read aloud at conference room one village hall for Doney, new york and be it further resolved that the board of trustees reserves the right to reject any and all bids waive any irregularities and accept the bid deemed most advantageous to the village of fredonia second all in favor say aye aye, aye. 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 opposed <coughs> yes. whereas title six nycr part 617.5 of the regulations relating to an article <coughs> of the Environmental Conservation Law of New York State, CICA requires that as early as possible in a proposed action and involved agency, agency shall make a determination whether to give an action subject to CICA and whereas all Board of Trustees of the Village of Fredonia had due notice of this meeting and that pursuant to Section 94 of the Public Officers Law, Public Meetings Law, said meeting was open to the general public and due and proper notice of the time and place therefore was given as required by law. And whereas a short form environmental assessment form prepared by O'Brien and Gear Engineers Incorporated of Syracuse, New York, covering the village's proposed action, said action being the village's reservoir spillway project along with plans, maps, and other supporting data and engineers reports and all prepared by O'Brien and Gear Engineers, which satisfactorily, satisfactorily describes the proposed project and which have been received and reviewed by this board and whereas the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation by this letter of November 7, 2011 requires the village to correct certain deficiencies at the village reservoir, which this project is intended to address now. Therefore, it be resolved that the Board of Trustees of the Village of Fredonia pursuant to Part 617 of the New York CRR hereby determines that the proposed actions does not involve any federal agency and is an unlisted action and be it further, further resolved that the Board of Trustees in the Village of Fredonia, after due deliberation and review of the O'Brien and Gear Engineers Seeker report and other information, hereby determines that the proposed action will not have a significant adverse impact on the environment and that this resolution shall continue to constitute a negative declaration for the purposes of Article 8 of the Environmental Conservation Law of the State of New York and be it further resolved that the mayor is hereby authorized to sign said seeker form on behalf of the village of Fredonia. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? <coughs> Whereas plans and specifications have been prepared by O'Brien and Gear Engineers Village Consulting <coughs> Engineers of Syracuse, New York for the Fed Fredonia Reservoir Spillway Project and whereas a short form environmental assessment form had been completed for said project and this board has found the project to be a type two action and a determination of no sig significant adverse impact has been made by this board. Now therefore be it resolved, said plans and specifications are hereby approved, and be it further resolved that the village clerk is hereby authorized to advertise for sealed bids for said project. Said bids to be returnable to the village clerk's office no later than 11 a.m. on Wednesday, March 28, 2012, at which time the bids 
shall be publicly opened and read aloud at the conference room one, Village Hall, Fredonia, New York. And be it further resolved that the Board of Trustees reserves the right to reject any and all bids, waive any irregularities, and accept the bid deemed most advantageous for the Village of Fredonia. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Passed. Okay, in addition to that, we will have a special meeting next Monday, uh, March 5th. The um, trustees will meet at 6 p.m.? Yeah. 6 p.m.? Yeah. Uh, to talk about budget, to follow with the meeting at 7.30. Need as a resolution? Need a second it? Oh, the mayor, the mayor can call, either the oh. board or the mayor can call special meeting. No, I just didn't know if we needed a second that or not. Or what the mayor just yeah. said? Mm -hmm. yeah. Did you put it in the form of a motion? Just say you, you can announce a special meeting. Mayor had it's one of your one of the few right rights that you have is to call. Flex those meeting. muscles. <laughs> right there you go. <laughs> well, make sure we're doing it right. That's all. <laughs> yep, that's all I do. Just announce it. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, anything else for the good of the, of the board? Do I hear a motion? Make motion, Bob. Do I have it second? Second. All in favor, say aye. 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 Opposed. We're. No.